What is up guys, Ben Allen back again, and in today's video, a short little like uh, studying for the board type of video. Uh, Broaden was kind enough to upload some study cards onto Quizlet for y'all, so we're gonna put that link down below, and pretty much you guys can click it, and these are the exact study cards that I use to study for the board, Broaden used to study the board, that pretty much our entire medic platoon has used to study for the board. And we're gonna make these available to you for free, no cost, just literally click the link down below, or maybe I'll put it somewhere up here if I can, if it's not up here, it's down there for sure, guys. But uh, without further ado, let's get into the video. Alright guys, what is up? So like I said, studying for the board, right? You know, most of the time people get told like, oh hey, you're going to the board in like two weeks or a week and you have like or no two idea. Days. Or two days. And you have no idea where to study, right? Or where to get information. You know, you're just frantically typing on the keyboard and Google like how to study for the board or watching one of my videos about how to study for the board, which I'll link up here. Uh, shameless plug, guys. But uh, yeah, so it's a really... It, it, boost your anxiety, it really boosts the stress that's on you because you're like, oh, you don't want to look bad in front of like the panel or anything like that. And so, uh, one of our old NCOs, uh, Staff Sergeant uh, Brianna Wilson, shout out to you, Sergeant Wilson, thank you for making the cards. Like, like I just said, she actually made those cards, guys, and they've been passed around the platoon and to other platoons, you know, since we've had them. And uh, Broaden had the bright idea to actually, you know, digitize them and put them on Quizlet so you guys can access them and just, you know, go through them and they're super tremendous guys. Like I said, they've helped me, they've helped Broaden, they've helped everybody study for the board and pass. We've had 100% pass rate across mm -hmm. the board. Eh, I wouldn't say 100, we had a few. We have one. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that's a different story, guys. But Fourth time's a charm. Fourth time's a charm. But uh, yeah, they're super beneficial, guys. Like these cards are super well written, super like, just put together. They're the basics, but they're also, that's, that's what they're testing you on, the basics to see if you're ready for that next level. And um, how was going through the board for you, Broden? So going through the board, like before I got there, I, I thought I was good, all right? So I studied real hard, like I had everything memorized, like my creed was good, my presentation was good, my bio was good. And then I got in there and like all at once, everything just out the ear, like <laughs> fucking the cork came unplugged and it just poured out. Um, but that's like, that's like part of the board. They want to see how you react to that type of situation. You're gonna go in there, you're gonna think you're, you're gonna crush this, and then you're gonna sit down and like you can't remember like the most basic information. It's like so one you, of the three types of north. Yeah, the th like it's something simple. Yeah, like, that's one of the questions they ask. Yeah, like which, uh, on a map, which direction is north? Well, it, it's gonna be at the top of the map. Yeah. Something simple like that might trip you up. And uh, that's what they're watching for is how well you carry yourself when you're not really sure what the answer is. Yeah. So the study cards are great to give you like that baseline and then after that it's all confidence. Yeah. Like confidence is key when you're in the board. Yep. Like and I have hella confidence. I'm a cocky motherfucker guys. If you know me I'm cocky. But um, yeah, if you're still watching this video, there's really no point. Like all the information was put on the front. This video is literally just to give you all the heads up that we have those Quizlet cards available to you. But since Broaden shared his board story, I'll share mine. So mine was kind of like the complete opposite. I was nervous up until the point I got in there. Like I was like, dude, shit, they're gonna ask me this stuff. Like what if I fuck up? You know, what if this happens? You know, that happens. And so I get in there and as soon as I walk in there, like my nerves were gone. I was like, dude, I got this. Like I studied for it. Like I studied those cards religiously. Like on my free time, I was going through them. Like it got to the point where people would say two words of the card and I would spit out the answer just because I memorized them so well. And I knew at that moment, like going in there, like just complete calmness, like just going in there, I was like, dude, this is my board, like I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass. Sure enough, I did pass. There was one, uh, there was one um, member of the board that asked me like a kind of hard question, right? And uh, I answered it like word for word. He was like, yeah, I got like five more questions, but I don't need to hear anymore. This guy's a good first sergeant. And they just kicked it off over to the next guy to ask me questions. Like, I only missed like a total of like maybe one question, if that, but then the one I did get wrong, I answered so respectfully and so confidently that it wasn't even technically wrong. Because if you don't know an answer to the question, the best response usually is like, oh, Sergeant Major, oh, First Sergeant, I do not know the answer to that question at this time, but I will look it up and I will get back to you with an answer. 
because like that. And if you don't know it exactly, know where it can be referenced. If you can know where to reference where that answer can be found, that's just as good or even better than actually knowing the answer. Because they're looking, like, because not even they know everything that's being asked, right? Like, part of, the, part of being an NCO, part of going to the board, whether it's promotion or soldier of the month, is knowing where to find things and knowing how to get an answer, right? Because you're not gonna know everything, you're not gonna remember everything. You know, like, I forget stuff every now and then, what do I do? I go back and I look at it, right? So whenever I have a board coming up or one of my guys has a board coming up, we bust out those cards and we study and they're a tremendous help. So we just thought, we'd, well, Broaden thought he'd make those available to you. I had no idea in it whatsoever. I just wanted to make this available to y'all. That way Broaden gets the recognition he deserves for putting those cards on Quizlet and uh, Sergeant Brianna Wilson gets the credit she deserves for actually making those cards to study for the board. So thanks to both of them. Uh, we really appreciate you guys. I'm sure they're gonna appreciate you guys. But uh, yeah, if you guys wanna reach us, feel free to do so at my Instagram, Ben underscore Allen 175. Best possible place to reach me. I answer all my DMs. I post some decent content every now and then. And uh, yeah, guys, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you aren't already. And uh, yeah, guys, I'm a pretty short dude if you guys were wondering. <laughs> Just broadens, broadens towering over me. But it's okay, like I'm I said. Yeah, here, just let me let me walk forward. There we go. Now we're the same size. This it, look, it looks like I'm trying to. But anyway, yeah. So guys, yeah. Again, be sure to comment down below what you're most excited for the board about, or what. Yeah, what you're most excited for the board, right? Or what do you think is gonna be the toughest part of the board? And uh, yeah, we'll see you on the next one later.